What is good YouTube, Warst you here with a video on Arrow Season 5, Legend Season 2, Flash Season 3. So this is a video that I've been holding off. I didn't want to make it. I didn't want to make it. I was giving them the benefit of doubt, but I've got to make a video on it. So what the fuck is going on with Katie Cassidy and what the fuck is going on in Mark Guggenheim's head? No, this is not a video coming at him. This is a video questioning what the fuck is going on. So I don't usually swear, but I'm a bit annoyed. So July the 23rd, 2016, let's set the scene. So an article comes out saying Katie Cassidy is the latest Blanty Burst actor, implying that she's going to be on Flash, Legends and Arrow. Actor to ink one of those cool deals by which she is now a season regular across multiple CW shows, namely The Flash, Legend of Tomorrow, and her original stomping ground, Arrow. So yeah, I thought this was wicked. I thought, awesome, okay, this means we're not going to be getting Black Canary back, back pro properly, but we're going to get her back in some capacity. And then we get Arrow episode 10, Who Are You?, and then it was a cool episode and then Black Siren ends up in jail. So I thought, ah, oh, cool. We're going to get the Legends of Tomorrow storyline where she's going to see Sarah and possibly she could join Legions of Doom or be a villain on that. Or possibly the Black Siren character in Arrow could turn into Black Canary. But no, what the fuck? So let's set the scene. February the 13th, sorry, 2007. Interview with Mark Guggenheim. We have an idea for how to see her again, implying Kate Cassidy, but we haven't made a deal with her yet. What the fuck? Seriously, come on. Okay, so let's go back to this first article. July 2016, she signs a contract to be on three shows. February, not even six months later, but we haven't made a deal with her yet. It's revealed. She's not a season regular anymore. But hang on a minute. This article says she's a season regular over three shows. So the story goes on. She's not a season regular anymore. So we have to make a contract with her. And she's got to be available. And we haven't had those conversations yet. But we have an idea. We know exactly what we want to do. So seriously, guys, what the fuck? So is Mark Guggenheim lying to us? Does he have a fucking clue what is going on? So firstly, they OK, not lied. Mark Guggenheim said in an interview in the public that Casey Cassidy would be on three shows. So we are on episode 12, 13 of most shows, halfway into the season, she's only appeared on Arrow briefly. She's not appeared on Flash, even though she broke out of a Flash jail. So that should have really happened on a Flash episode. And she's nowhere to be seen in Legends Tomorrow. And they're on like episode 12. They've only got 17. So basically, Legends Tomorrow is over. And she, well, they've recorded most of the season. They've most likely got a couple of that. Probably like two or three episodes left. And Black Siren is nowhere to be seen. I didn't want to make a video like this. But I can see why the Katie Cassidy fans are getting pissed off. They're not so pissed off more uh, so much about Diana Drake potentially becoming Black Canary. They are pissed off that Mark Guggenheim lied about the whole Black Siren arc. Her redemption. So she basically got her redemption in the last 10 minutes of Arrow season five, episode 10, who are you? When she basically uh, just ended up in jail. So I know Oliver said he's going to try and turn her into like her lower basically. So there are multiple ways they could bring her back. They could turn her into the black canary on Arrow, or like I said before, they could use her in Legends of Tomorrow as an ally with Sarah, or they could use her in the Illusion of Doom. The potential for the Black Siren character is so high. Her acting skills on Black Siren was much better than she ever did as Laurel Lance and Black Canary. 
But personally, I don't think this we're ever going to see her again because it's all right. An article saying, don't worry, Katie Cassidy will be back. But what the fuck? I mean, we knew in July she was supposed to be on three shows this year. So it turns out that she's most likely not going to be on any show to at least like Ari season six, Legend season three, Flash season four. I mean, let me know in the comments down below. Let's try and get this video up to 50 likes if we can. Now, 50 is a bit too high. And let's try and get it up to 20 likes if we can. So, guys, comment down below. Do you think Mark Guggenheim is twisting his words cleverly? Or do you think he's just kind of clickbait people in to watching Arrow as these episodes with Kate Cassidy were heavily marketed? We got to see Kate Cassidy in the trailers weeks before she appeared. So, yes, Katie Cassidy is a big draw for Arrow. And since all this drama happened after Arrow 5 or 10, who are you? Arrow's ratings have fucking dropped down. They've dropped so low that it's the lowest viewed CW show in terms of the DC shows at the moment. When really it should be the second highest because the storyline, in my opinion, is quite compelling. It's a solid storyline. But the Katie Cassidy fans will not watch because they're sick and tired of being lied to. And I'm going to overlay pictures and stuff so you can see articles. And I'll put a link in the description to both articles so you can see the times that I'm not lying. July 23rd, 2016, February, literally a few days ago. So, guys, let's have a conversation down below. I've got no idea what's going on. Do you know what's going on? Does Kate Cassidy know what's going on? Because from this article, she doesn't know what's going on. And does Mark Guggenheim know what's going on? We have an idea. We know what, exactly what we want to do. But you haven't contacted her. What the fuck? You don't need to contact her because you've already said she's contracted to be in three shows for the whole season. Anyway, guys, I don't usually make videos like this. As you know, Wall Street is a happy-go-lucky kind of person. But I want to address this for people that don't actually make YouTube videos. I just want to address it in a video on their behalf, on the kind of Katie Cassidy, Laura Lance behalf. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you in the video. If you are new, please think about hitting that like button. Think about subscribing if you want to and you want, to, you want more videos like this and other kind of things. And we'll catch you in the video. Peace out, guys.